Good day everyone. Today we shall be considering mathematical induction. By the way, this is Gifted Brain aka Saizu, first in Africa, sixth in the world. Yeah, this is another example on the mathematical induction. The question says, show that the expression of 5 raised to power 2 n plus 3 n minus 1 is a multiple integer of 9. Quite easily done. Uh, what we just what the question is asking us to do is that we should prove that 5 raised to power 2 n plus 3 n minus 1 is a multiple of 9. It's 9 times something. 9 times something. Okay. Well, this is a little bit different from the other questions we've been solving. But the method is still very, very similar. And the first thing to do as usual is to select n. Let n be equal to 1. And here, if n is equal to 1, we have 5 raised to power 2 times 1 times 1 plus 3 multiplied by 1 and minus 1. Yeah, so this will give us 5 raised to the power 2, which is 25. So 25 plus 3 minus 1. That gives us 27. And we can see that 27 itself is a multiple of 9, 9 times 3. And so that is correct for n equal to 1. So we can move on to step number 2. Now, step number two, we say let n, let n be equal to k. And then we have 5 raised to power 2k plus 3n, 3k now, just replacing the n by k minus 1, is a multiple of 9, 9 into bracket m. You see this equation, I'll call it, I'll just call it equation 1 actually. I'll call this equation 1. And so, what I will just do now is to say the last step. Let n be equal to k plus 1. Let n be equal to k plus 1. And it means that anyway I see n, substitute it with k plus 1. So this will be 5 raised to power k plus 1, 2 into k plus 1. plus 3 into k plus 1 then minus 1 okay so let's see if this will give us a multiple of 9 what we just have here is 5 raised to power if i expand the bracket in the in the power we have 2k plus 2 and then plus 3k plus 3 minus 1 and so this 5 to 5 raised to power 2k plus 2 can be written as 5 2k multiplied by multiplied by 5 raised to power 2 by indices law of indices and so plus 3k plus 2 the law of indices I'm implying is that remember that we have that. If imagine if I say five raised to power two multiplied by five raised to power two k, law of indices tells me to add up the power. That will give me five raised to power two k plus two. So if I have five raised to power two k plus two, I can also write it as five raised to power two multiplied by five raised to power two k. So that's that about that. Now, the five raised to power two can be simplified to be twenty five. So I have twenty five now into 5 raised to power 2k plus 3k plus 2. So, but I will say from that equation I call equation 1. From equation 1. From equation 1. You know, we have equation 1 to do that. We have, we have 5 2k 5 raised to power 2k, sorry, plus 3k minus 1, being a multiple of 9. I can make 5 2k, so a formula there, 5 raised to power 2k, so a formula there, 
5 over 2k will actually give me the 9m itself minus 3k plus 1. So let me substitute. Substitute. Let me call this question 2. Substitute. And let me call this our last equation before here. Let me call this equation equation. Okay, let me call this equation two. And let me call this equation three. So substitute. Substitute. Equation one. Equation three into into equation two. So what I what I actually mean is that where I have the five two k. In equation 2 here this 5 2k here i will substitute this value for it which is 9m plus 3 this value 9m plus 3k plus 1 so let me do that now so we have 25 into 9m 9m minus 3k plus 1 then plus 3k and plus 2. If I expand this, 25 times 9 will give me 225. 225m minus 75k plus 25 plus 3k plus 2. So this will give us again 225m. then minus 72k when i collect the like terms and then plus 27. now so look at this now how do we confirm that this is a multiple of nine when it, nine can be factorized out of it if nine is factorized out if nine is factorized out nine is factorized out we have 45 sorry not 45 sorry 25 we have 25 m minus 8 k plus 3 and so this that about that we will take uh, so i will give you some exercises where you can uh, then solve and then try those exercises on your own so you can uh, try the following exercises on your own